What up, Dribble fam? Welcome back to another video. Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a long, long, long time, and I say it every single time I come back. But today is one of those videos that I'm dreading to record. <laughs> but I've been wanting to do this for a while now, but I just didn't want to, I guess. I haven't had the courage to do it, but I'm gonna... <sighs> I'm gonna shave my hair off. I'm gonna shave my hair off. Not because people want me to cut it, but because I feel it's time to cut it. A lot of people have tried to put me down or try to say negative things about me just because of my hair and this. And I've come to a point in my life right now where I need to cut it, I need to just throw away the old me to welcome a new me, if that makes sense. And I feel like this right here is a big weight. Not because it's heavy, but because it has, it has so much meaning to it. Like there's so much of me in here that I feel like I need to let go in order to allow different aspects of myself to come into play. <laughs> There's so much pain, so much hatred, so much verbal abuse, mental abuse, low self-esteem in this. My hair has gone through so much mess alongside me. I'm gonna mess my hair so much. <laughs> Hopefully it didn't make that much of a mess that my barber can't fix tomorrow. How's it look? Pretty good? I'll see you guys in just a snap of a finger. I'm about to I'm kind of annoyed because I did this thing already. Stop, son. Gosh, you're in my way. I had recorded all this already and I went to go check to turn the camera off and I wasn't recording. But look, guys, I'm bald. I'm bald. I'm super duper 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 bald. What you guys think? 
Is he no good? I know. Let me know down in the comment section down below. Tell me what you think of this new hair, of this new me. Um, yes, it's two days after I cut my own hair, um, where I screwed up my own hair, or I me atrasquele super duper bad. Um, just for those that are gonna be wondering and asking, the reason why I decided to go about the up when I'm not trying to have a deep conversation right now. The whole reason why I decided to cut my hair was because I needed a new start, like a refresh button, and I think cutting out off my hair and shaving my head off is that. Um, with my man bun, I loved it. it was every second of it, you know, getting it braided up, getting fixed up, it was good. It was, I love, I love my hair. I love my long hair. But certain people did not like it. Certain um, people around me did not weren't fans of it. And not because I, I wanted to placerlos to have shorter hair. Not because of that, but because their toxic words were too much and too often, and they were coming from people that. And throughout the years, they were they. It was a constant attack on my appearance of my long hair and then why do I have my long hair? It's just, it gets to you at some point. And I was over it. Just everything happening around while I was in Mexico were just telling me, you know, it's time for you. It's time for yourself. It's it's just it's just time to just do you and not care what anybody thinks. Now this new attitude I have about myself and this new, new focus I have, it needed something different. It needed something more to like really say it's the new me, you know? And giving yourself a new look, just go for it. For many years, I always joked with my friends, oh, I'm gonna shave my hair, I wish I'd do my hair, I'm gonna... About. I needed to look in the mirror and see somebody else. I didn't want to see the same person again. So yeah, that's the whole reason why. Like, I didn't do it to complacer a nadie. No, me corté el pelo para complacer absolutamente a nadie, a ninguna persona, um, a, ningún, a ningún familiar, a ningún amigo, a nadie. Lo hice por mí. And that's the bottom line of it. Um, yes, when I had my long hair, I had a lot of toxic people. A, to a lot of toxic uh, friends and family members that just try to put me down for the way I decided to look and the way I decided to cut my hair. And there were hard times, and there were hard conversations, and I, times that I had to tell people off that I shouldn't have be that I shouldn't be telling off. But things happen for a reason, and I'm here. Comment down below. Let me know down in the comment section what you guys think of my hair. If you haven't already, and if you haven't already, please give this video a big thumbs up. It would mean the world to me. And yeah, help me grow this dribble fan. I want this dribble fan to grow times a million. I don't know. Who knows where this could take me and us and, you know, and I can't do it without your guys' support. So please subscribe down below. Share this video with your family and friends. Have them subscribe. Please, it will mean the world to see this dribble fan grow until 2018. There's a lot of fun things coming out in 2018. I have a lot of pre-recorded videos with my long hair. <laughs> I'm gonna just cry when I edit those. Happy holidays, and I'll see you next time. And peace. Tú me llamabas cada noche. Necesitando mi calor, llamaba cada noche.